Are you experiencing lag or latency whenever you play the new Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 on Steam? In this video, we'll walk you through the solutions that you can try to get you back to gaming normally without lag again. By the way, please like and share our videos to help those who might have the same issues so that we can help them too. Once you're done, then let's begin. Fix number one, close and restart the game. Force quitting the game is a quick and, in some cases, reliable fix for this problem. Be sure to give the game a full restart. If Warzone appears to be frozen or unresponsive and you can't close it normally, force close it using the task manager instead. Fix number two, restart your console. If nothing has changed after closing the game, the next step is to ensure that you refresh your PC. A quick restart might be helpful in this case if the cause is a minor bug in your computer. Fix number three, verify servers are working. This is an often forgotten troubleshooting step by players who thinks that the issue lies with their PC or internet connection at home. Visit the official Activision website and check if Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 is currently having an issue. Fix number four, check for game updates. Keeping the game software up to date is a no-brainer. Not only does updates bring fixes to known issues, but at times, they also improve performance due to coding tweaks. Fix number five, run the game in lower settings. Even if Call of Duty Warzone 2.0 lag or latency issues only occur when you're in a match, it can also be occur if your PC is running out of resources to run the game normally. Your computer is supposed to pick the default graphics settings for you in this game. However, if you think that you can change something yourself to further improve the situation, then you better do it. Fix number six, run a speed test. If your internet connection is too slow, you may experience issues while trying to join a match in Warzone 2. Doing a few internet speed tests is a good way to assess the quality of your internet connection. In addition to other potential causes of latency, a connection speed of 5 Mbps or less may prevent you from consistently connecting to the game servers. Next, disconnect other devices from your network. Congestion in a network can develop when several devices try to access the internet at once. If Call of Duty, Warzone 2 stutters or lags only while several people are at home watching Netflix, downloading large files, or playing online games, you may have a bandwidth problem. Next, play with a wired connection. If you rely on Wi-Fi when playing, we suggest that you switch to a wired setup to see if that will help. A wired connection is faster and can reduce lag considerably due to minimum chance of wireless signal interference. Next, use QoS. In order to reduce network latency, frame drops, or reduce ping rate in games, certain routers include the ability to prioritize game packets. This feature is called quality of service. If your router supports QoS, activate it for Steam by googling the specific procedures for your equipment. Next, get help from your ISP. If what you did so far has not reduced lag or latency at this point, I suggest that you contact your ISP so they can help you diagnose the issue. If your download speeds are low, you may want to consider upgrading your internet plan. That's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it. If you can leave a like or comment, subscribe to our channel or share this video to your friends, this can greatly help in making Google's algorithm can find and recommend this video to others.